If you guys are looking for the cheapest and most reliable coins on the market, make sure to head over to utnice.com. You're going to click on FIFA 21 right here. Choose your platform you're buying coins on. Choose the amount of coins you'd like to purchase. Click buy now and then put in the discount code CHIEF for 6% off your order. Now let's go ahead and let's get right into this video. What's up guys, it's Feef Chief here and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we have for you some more insane trading methods that are going to help you make a ton of coins on FIFA 21. Now if you are enjoying the content or you are new around here, I ask that you guys do please hit that subscribe button. We're going to try to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of FIFA 21, so it would mean a lot if you did subscribe. And then make sure to check out all the links in the description, like Twitch for all my daily live streams, Discord for all sorts of trading advice and investments, and then all the other links down there as well. And with all that said, let's go ahead and let's jump right into these trading methods. So guys, I got two different methods for you today which are basically just going to be quick flipping methods to make you really easy coins just constant income so the first thing we're going to be looking at here and if you are watching right now would you please 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 hit the like button press the thumbs up it does help me out a lot the first thing we're going to be looking at is we're going to go quality silver and we're going to go nation argentina now these are both going to be low budget methods to just quickly flip cards like i mentioned so all argentinian silvers as you can see here are going to be Basically, they're going to sell for 400 coins. 350, they'll basically insta sell. And basically, a really easy way to make coins, which kind of flies under the radar, in my opinion, is you could easily just sit here and win every single card on bid for 200 coins. If you just go through and bid 200 coins, you'll win basically every card. And you'll just double your coins on every single card you win. It is literally as simple as this. A lot of these you'll get for 150 as well if no one else is bidding on them. Get them for 200. It simply does not matter. And I just kind of want to show you how much profit you can make in such a like a short period of time doing this. So I went ahead and I won some cards before the video. We're going to bid on some cards here as well. And something you can do, you could do sniping if you wanted to. My thing with sniping is you're you're probably going to win every card that pops up, but it's just not as efficient as bidding. You don't win as many cards. I think you're better served just doing bidding the whole time. And we got another method after this. So we're going to jump in and kind of list up some of these cards we want to show you the profit and then get into the next method. Someone is actually doing a bit of Argentina right now. So the next method might be better. And you could probably guess it just from looking at what you've seen there. But I mean, if we just go in and sell all these cards and what i tell people as well is you do always want to check the prices of every single card you're selling because a lot of cards do go for different prices based on their position based on things like pace since these cards only have value due to icon swaps the cards that are going to sell for more are the cards that are better in game so pacey cards are going to go for more cards with good positions are going to go for more higher rated cards are going to go for more so it's important to check the price of every card you could just sit there and list up every card for 400 and you'd still make good profit but you might be missing out on some coins by doing that so i recommend checking prices but getting into our second method here as i mentioned you may have been able to guess it what you're going to do is you're just going quality quality silver nation brazil now this method right now looks to be working better which works in our favor because these brazilians actually go for a bit more wow rainier there went for 300 right away these brazilians go for about 450 and we like it when these cards are going for more it makes this method easier so selling for 450 you could win every card here for 300 make 150 coins a card just like that so i'd be willing to bid up to 300 coins on all these it looks like i'll be able to win them all for 150 50 or 200 anyway which is going to be really nice profit so we go ahead and we just bid on all these and i just want to show you guys literally just how easy it is to make coins on a low budget and even with like 360k as i have on this account i'm still like doing this method when i'm just kind of sitting around not doing anything as we've won 13 cards here like if i'm sitting there watching another streamer i'll go ahead and i'll do this method if i'm sitting there and again check prices this guy goes 700 um if i'm sitting there watching a show maybe i'll just sit there and do this because it's just continuous income i mean we've made we made what 500 coins on that first card 200 on that one we're going to make another 300 on this card. So we've made over a thousand coins just like that. And you can see just how quickly and oh my, 
I don't know if this guy's actually going to sell for this, but I'm going to list him up for relatively high and just see if he goes. I feel like there's no way, but if so, we've made like three and a half K on that card. And again, if you were to get like a league SBC card, like this MLS guy, he looks like he goes for about a thousand coins here. This MLS guy, not quite the same, just going to be the 450. And you just keep winning the guys, keep listing them up and just continuously cycle through this. It's a bit of a grind, but if you want coins right now, right this instant, this is probably one of my favorite ways to do it. Even if you have a very high budget, these low budget methods are just so reliable and just consistently give you coins that you just can't really go wrong with them because there isn't potential to lose coins on these either. Now, if you're on a high budget, a majority of making your coins per usual, like I mentioned, is going to be from just investments. So this is a great way if you were to invest if you've got 500k and you invest 400k into something that I put in the Discord or make a video on, then you're down to 100k. You could just sit here and do this method. And as you can see, I mean, we're just we're winning every single card here. <laughs> we're winning every card for like 150, 200, just all over the place. It's just rapid coins with this method. And it's something, again, where if you're just turning your nose at it because you're like, well, I have 200k, I want to trade with icons, you can't be doing that. Like, when there's a method that's this simple and you're making 200 to 300 coins a card and you can win 20 cards in a minute, so if you win 20 cards in a minute, say you make 200 coins a card, you've made 4k in a minute there. 4k in a minute off that and you can see these are selling as well you can, well these are some of my road to glory investments that have sold but if we go to the end here i mean look at all these cards that are selling already it's it's absolutely rapid how quickly we make these coins it is incredible it is absolutely incredible so i kind of have to wait to list the rest of those cards up but as you can see we've just got tons and tons of stuff to sell here it is fantastic and as we're recording this the boy aaron davis subscribes to the youtube aaron if you're watching this video you're a legend my friend you're a legend and again, I just kind of want to show you, it's probably going to be rel relatively easy to snipe these cards. They won't pop up super quick, but any card that you see, you're most likely going to get. It's just like, you can't beat bidding on these cards though, with how easy it is. I mean, just even sniping, we didn't even get that card right away. There's basically no point in trying to snipe these cards, in my opinion, because of how easy it is to win them on bid. And like this striker, 88 pace, 70 shooting, this is probably a good example of a guy where you want to check the price because he's going to sell for 800 coins rather than listing him for 450 or 500. If you get these cards that are good in game, always, always, always check the prices. It's going to be another great way to make coins for you. And you can just see how many of these just have no or very low bids on them. It's incredible. It's absolutely incredible. And you do, you just keep doing this method. And I'll typically rotate between Brazil and Argentina, do them both at the same time. Or if I find that someone is doing one of the methods, I will just stick with the other nation. Like it seems like someone is doing the Argentina method because there seems to be a lot of bids rolling in on that. And I'm winning basically every Brazil card. So there's no point in me doing Argentina if Brazil is this easy. And, and again, Brazil, if they're selling for 450, I'd bid up to 300 because that's still, I could bid up to 400 and still make profit after tax. But another point here with these methods is these silvers will change in price a lot throughout the week, um, basically just due to different supply like squad battles, marquee matchup supply, uh, foot champs or with things like that. The the prices on these will change a lot due to supply. So you always need to make sure you're checking your prices you're buying at and checking your prices you're selling at because you just want to make sure you're doing things at the appropriate price so you don't have any way of losing coins or your transfer list just gets filled up because items you're winning aren't selling. So you just kind of need to be smart about that as well. Uh, just knowing that you can't always stick with the prices I showed you here because those will in fact change. But right when you see this, I'm literally recording this like 20 minutes before this video goes up. So... Again, it, uh, these prices will be very similar if you're going to do this right away. But again, like 400 coins for these Argentinians and I can win them 200 apiece without sweating 250. I could 
just take every card if I wanted to and just double my coins on everything. I mean, that is just, that's just, it's what we call free coins. It is legitimately what we call three, what we call free coins. But guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video.